All right, so this one comes up a lot. It's, can you use a Google form and have a different set of questions based upon a answer that somebody has given somewhere in the form? And the answer is yes. And the way that we do that is using sections and questions and what we call form logic. So let's get into it. So here I've got a choose your own adventure question, a mountain adventure or beach adventure. What I'm going to do is I'm going to create a section. That's these two little, looks like an equal sign, but those are sections. And so we're going to do a mountain section. And we're also going to go ahead and set up a beach section, right? Okay. So if I go back up to this section and I add a question, here's where I can make my unique questions based upon the answer that somebody gave. So this would be unique mountain question. All right. And we're going to do the same in the beach section down here. So we're going to add a question and we're going to say unique beach ah, question. Can't type today. All right. And so at the end, we're also going to add a last section, which is just kind of where everybody comes back together in the form. So uh, the final section and we'll add last question there. OK, so we've got our four sections set up, right? So we've got the first one, which is choose your own adventure. Now, what we want to do is when we select this question, we want to go down to the three dots and we want to click on go to section based on answer. So here we've got a multiple choice. We've got our mountain adventure. And what we're going to do here is we're going to go to section two mountain. And for the beach one, we're going to do the exact same thing, except we're going to check the beach selection and that should do it. So what will happen now is when somebody fills out the form, when they get to the mountain or beach, they'll select mountain or beach that will actually send them to that section. And right here, we're going to go to section based on answer. Um, so it'll send them to the mountain or the beach section. And then what we want to do is at the end of those mountain or beach questions, we want to drive them back to the final question. So right here in the drop down, we're going to say go to final section. And in the beach section, we're going to do the exact same thing. We're going to go to section based on answer. And as you guessed it, we're going to go to the final section and then that will drive everybody depending upon which path they choose. They'll all end up at that final one. So that is a very quick demo of how you can use form logic to be able to ask unique questions based upon answers and uh, avoid people having to just bash through a bunch of questions that aren't relative to them. All right. There you go.